What's up guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're gonna be driving up to Santa Barbara from Los Angeles and we're gonna ask the question, can you make it to Santa Barbara and back on one charge from Los Angeles? Let's get in the video. So Santa Barbara is about 100 miles away from Los Angeles one way. So round trip is about 200 miles. I actually made a video where we went to San Diego and back and that's about 240 miles. And we actually arrived back in Los Angeles with only 20%. So I do expect this range test, we should arrive back in Los Angeles with more than 20%, maybe 30% or 40%. It looks like we're gonna arrive in Santa Barbara with 62% of the battery as we left. We did charge the battery up to 99% or 100% last night, but with overnight degradation, we left with about 99% of the battery. I'm gonna go ahead and check in when we're half of the way there to Santa Barbara, just to see how we're doing on the battery. Thanks for watching another video. If you're new here, my name is Dennis. I just picked up the Tesla Model 3 and I make videos about my experience, including a weekly autopilot video in Los Angeles traffic. So if you're interested in any of that, please hit that subscribe. All right, so we're about halfway there. Another 54 miles or so left, or 50 minutes. We should be arriving at around 11, 11 a.m. We left around 9.30 a.m., so we're doing pretty good on time. Uh, traffic wasn't too bad leaving out of Los Angeles, and there really hasn't been any traffic around here either. In terms of the battery, we have 81% of the battery left, and now it's saying we're gonna arrive with 65% of the battery instead of the 62% it was predicting earlier. So that means we're doing pretty good on our drive. Uh, we haven't really increased past 75 miles an hour, mostly 73 miles an hour on our drive, so, we would, so we're conserving the battery pretty well. Hopefully we'll arrive a little bit earlier than 1111 or 1112, depending on the traffic out here on the 101 North. All right, so we're a little bit more than halfway there. We have 48 miles to go or 45 minutes. We're passing through Oxnard at the moment. We should be arriving at 11, 11 a.m. What's really interesting is that we're currently at 81% battery or 80% battery and we should be arriving or now it's saying we're gonna arrive at 64% battery. Uh, when we left, it was initially saying 57 or 62% battery and now it's increased to 64% battery. We've maintained a pretty good speed of 70 to 75 miles an hour. Not too much traffic leaving Los Angeles, so the bumper to bumper traffic probably helped a little bit with our range. We're passing through Oxnard right now and then on our way to Santa Barbara. All right, so we're about 10 minutes away or 11 miles or 11 minutes. We should be arriving at 11, 10. The good news is we're at 68% battery right now. We're gonna be arriving with 64% battery, which is above what was expected earlier of only 57 or 62% of the battery. We're just stopping by in Santa Barbara for a quick meeting and then we'll be on our way back to Los Angeles. All right, so we just finished our meeting in Santa Barbara, doing a bug check of the bumper right now. It seems to be pretty good. Not too many bugs out right now. Good thing is no rock chips, it looks like. Oh, actually, maybe a little bit right there. Oh, no, it's, it's good, actually. All right, we're gonna head back right now. And we, when we get back, we're gonna see how much battery is left on the Tesla. So putting our destination in the navigation, it looks like it's going to be 104 miles. It's gonna take a little bit less than two hours. We're gonna arrive at 2.42 p.m. In terms of battery, we have 60% of the battery. So it looks like we lost 2% while we we're sitting there, when we we're in our meeting. And we're gonna arrive with 21% of the battery. So basically the same as going to San Diego is to Santa Barbara with the same amount of battery. Hopefully we can do better on our drive back, only going 75 miles an hour or less uh, but we'll see when we get back to see where the battery's at all right guys 
guys, we're about halfway there. It's another 55 miles to go or an hour and 26 minutes. We should be arriving around 322. Currently the battery's at 46% and it looks like we've gone a different route back to Los Angeles because now it's saying that we're gonna arrive with 26% of the battery instead of 19 to 20%. So if we increase some efficiency, which 5% of the battery is about maybe 40 to 45 miles of extra range. So that's pretty nice to see that we've added some range back uh, and some efficiency. We're cruising at about 75 miles an hour, nothing more. And hopefully we won't run into too much traffic heading back into LA. All right, of course, we are definitely in some traffic. We're about 18 miles away from Los Angeles and it's gonna take us 48 minutes to get back. We're gonna arrive at 3.21 p.m. And in terms of the battery, it looks like it's gone up a little bit more from 26% to 28%. We're at 32% right now and we're gonna arrive back in Los Angeles with 28% of the battery. All right, so we made it back with 27% left on the battery. It's about 3.30 right now, so made it back all the way through Los Angeles traffic. So to answer the question, you can make it to Santa Barbara and back on Los Angeles, with, and you'll have about 27% left on the battery and or 84 miles, give or take. Los Angeles to Santa Barbara and back is about 200 miles round trip, so that means this would probably get about maybe 270, uh, maybe 260 at a highway speed, because most of it is highway speed. There was a lot of traffic coming back into Los Angeles. A good amount of bumper to bumper traffic, maybe 30 to 45 minutes of it, but we still made it back okay and we still have made it back okay and we have a lot of battery left on the Tesla. But yeah, thanks for watching. Hit that like if you enjoyed this video and comment below if you, if you have a 200 mile trek on your daily commute. I'd love to hear your thoughts. All right guys, I'll see you in the next one. See ya.